it's Betsy and Mom from Happily Ever After, etc. And what are we doing today, Mom? We're building my compost bin for my birthday present. So Mom has been asking me to build her a compost bin for a couple years. Couple years. She literally has a pile of junk, dead junk. crap, and yeah. stuff that she's essentially made a compost pile. But she wants a pallet compost pile. So this is not going to be your prettiest compost pile or your work. fanciest, but it's going to be quick and cheap and easy and exactly what she wants. We're going to make three bins. My brother and I are putting this together for her birthday. So we are going to go ahead and get started. We figured we need nine pallets. I got a couple extra just for the wood. Um, and we're going to start putting it together. We're just going to leave y'all on fast forward. And then once we figure out kind of what we're doing, I'll give y'all a closer look, maybe on the third one. <laughs> so I'm just going to set y'all to fast forward. You can watch this work. And then if you want to check out the how to actually do this portion, I'll leave a timestamp for where in the video you can find that. But it is freezing out here. It was 30 degrees last night. When you're just standing, I was sowing seeds last night and I was freezing, but when you're actually working, it is hot. So let's get started. All right, we are almost done. We're going to put this last board on. So we are not doing this, like I said, any fancy way. I'm sure there's much better, more official, fancy schmancy ways to do it. Here, hold that well. All we're doing is we have some long screws and some short screws and we're going from one board into the next board. less resistance when I strip it like that. Here, do you want me to do one from the back on this top side? Mm -hmm. Like through here? Okay. The main goal is to just get through as many parts of the board as you can. Also, I drop a lot of screws. Don't worry, I pick them all up. We don't want any of the dogs to get them. Daisy, you coming to inspect? Oh, yes. That's my Daisy. So are you building a house? It looks like it could be my house. doesn't want to pull it together right there. And it's because these two boards, this board is bowed a little more, so they're not flush against each other.
going through like this part if you can. thinking it's just hitting like one of these needles yeah that's what I, I don't see. think it's the drill I'm just gonna go and make them here yeah that'll be better can see we've done all three sections across the front so we have three big openings for all her compost we are going to cut some extra boards we got an extra pallet over here for wood so we can put another board here and here we also had this teeny tiny pallet that we were going to use for the second side here but it was way too small so Will had the great idea of using it to shore up this middle pallet since you can see it is much thinner than the beefier side pallets. So then we will at least put chicken wire on the back to hold things in from all these larger openings. And I have a board to put across the front here for a little extra stability. And then we will probably be done. It's going together pretty easy. Now, of course, it's, like I said, it's not pretty. There are screws coming out in many places, but, you know, mom's very happy, and it will hold her giant pile of compost. Right, Daisy? So that's the goal. All right, we're going to keep going. All right, it is all finished. So we ended up putting an extra board here and an extra board here just for added security. We also added a long board across the front. We are going to add chicken wire on the outsides and probably on these interior walls just so that A, stuff can't fall through when we're adding little things to the compost pile but also so that all the mini dogs can't come in and out everywhere because they will. So we're going to go get Chicken Wire tonight. We're going to go see the new Ant-Man movie. So Ant-Man and Chicken Wire priorities. And then we will be finished. We'll probably do that off camera. So, you know, you need a quick and dirty compost pile that gets the job done. This guy was free. We didn't pay anything for these pallets. Hope you guys liked this project. If you want to see more things that I've made out of pallets, click here. I made an entire walkway out of pallets two years ago. It's held up beautifully. And that one was also fairly free. Bye, y'all.